there in not just Mayfield, Kentucky. I, I know there's been a lot of focus on Mayfield and Edwardsville, Illinois, uh, but this this tornado really trekked uh, across hundreds of miles. We're talking about more than 500 miles, what we're seeing here. Yeah, and this graphic shows you um, the supercell thunderstorm, the parent thunderstorm that really was responsible for producing the tornado in Mayfield, Kentucky uh, late in the night. But it started all the way here in Arkansas. Central Arkansas is a little sort of innocuous looking little feature on the radar a bit of a supercell structure started to develop and then moved throughout the evening and overnight hours and eventually in the early morning hours near the Ohio River all along the way producing at least one we know of obviously but who knows how many tornadoes in this family it could have been one entirely uh, hundreds of miles long tornado we'll find that out with the information coming from the surveys and you know dr pista i think it's important to point out because when we look at this we know exactly what's happening but we're immersed right. in this so if you're looking at this and you're saying well what are